this morning, I'm trying to do my breakfast a little bit. Um, we're not going out till like 1 o'clock and we're doing 4 and a half hours today. So my breakfast today is pretty kind of low carb, moderate protein, high fat, um, but also high in fibre. It's something I wanted to try, wanted to try for a while. Something to pimp my, uh, my omelette up, uh, my three egg, three whole egg omelette plus one egg white, is some mozzarella. Um, it's, you know, light mozzarella, so it's not, like, really, really bad, but, um, I heard that, like, putting it in your omelette, like, folding the omelette over in the mozzarella makes it, like, real creamy and, like, quite chewy. To get my fibre in as well, um, what I would have done is had some chickpeas, but we haven't got any. So I'm going for haricot beans. I put them in the oven, not for very long, uh, with some olive oil and, um, just some pepper and uh, <clears throat> if you spread them out they'll tend to cook faster and the olive oil will make them like a little bit crispy it'll stop them from burning for for the haricot beans um, a full can is 21 grams of carbs one gram of fat and then 13 grams of protein so it's like 60 percent carbs and 30 percent uh, protein but um, here's the thing I'm serious Here's the thing about like fiber, 18 and a half grams of fiber. So that's like most of my fiber for the whole day. So in terms of breakfast as a whole, um, it's going to be about 25% carbs, 32% uh, fat and 44% protein. At like around 10, I'm going to have, because um, today's ride is four and a half hours and it's going to be a little bit kind of, because it's a little bit intense back to back. I'm going to have like half a tub of yoghurt, about 250 grams. I'm going to have about uh, 55 grams of muesli uh, and then 20 cashews and 20 almonds. And that's going to be like my kind of pre-pre-ride uh, meal. And then just before I head out, I'm going to have some dates and some peanut butter um, on that. So turn it into a cookery YouTube channel. You kind of want to line it like this. And hopefully it'll melt. Whoa! That's hot enough. I don't know if you can see, but like this here, that's all like the oozing mozzarella coming out around the edge. The beans have come out really well, and uh, they're actually like what you gotta do. That's the reason why you use like the, uh, the tin foil, the aluminum foil. <laughs> um, it just makes it easier to scrape them off. But yeah. Pretty good.